Hello everyone, I am Saurabh. I am talking uh, today uh, an important topic uh, of electrostatic and its applications. And uh, you can see here, uh, this is electrostatic and its applications uh, which I am wrote here in, uh, as a heading. And uh, what is the meaning of electrostatics? Electrostatics, statics means rest and the electro means the charge. Charge that means the study of charge at rest is called electrostatics and according to the definition you can see here the branch of physics which deals with the electric charges at rest is called the electrostatics that is uh, I am just writing here the study of charge at rest is called electrostatics and you can see also uh, there is a synthetic uh, cert and there is a uh, also uh, a cotton uh, uh, woolen cloth and there is a you can see here when uh, we take off our synthetic shirts or nylon sweater especially in dry weather the ex uh, we experience to of seeing a spark and hearing a crackle sound which is uh, already phenomenon in general life we can always see this phenomena in general life we also ex feel experience uh, we feel sensation of electric shock while opening the door of the car after just deboarding the running cars Yes, uh, we, we will notice a lot of shock, a lot of a large shock, electric shock. It's a small shock, but we feel there. And there is same phenomena. Uh, you can see here the uh, hair of this baby uh, just uh, spread out due to the same positive charge created on the hair. And uh, when you uh, just rub the balloon uh, on and stick on the t-shirt otherwise on the wall it will sticks due to the uh, loss of charge or due to the gain of charge some charge uh, appears on the balloon or some charge also replaced from the balloon after rubbing sometimes we also observe that petrol tankers just, just you can see here this is a petrol tankers have a metal chain dragging along the ground metal bodies cars and trucks get discharged because of friction and air rushing past them yes uh, the charge produced leak to the ground through this chain otherwise chain uh, hang just in back of this uh, tanker or otherwise in front of this tanker now these days you are uh, they, we are using tires of car and truck are made of uh, adding a carbon compound to the rubber which leaks the charge to the ground very easily if you are going to talking about the applications of electrostatic, there are first applications we are generally used in and we are generally see this application is the photocopying, the machine of photocopy working on the principle of electrostatics and you see here there is a original document where we put here and this is the lamp which is scan these original documents and you finally out uh, get your outside the paper after scanning which is you say that it's a photocopy. Yes and other one other one uh, the electrostatic is also used in atomic structure you can uh, use the atomic structure is explained on the basis of the electrostatics you can see this uh, these are the just like a uh, caffeine the structure of the caffeine the structure of nacl the structure of h2o the structure of graphite and so on these are all are explained by the help of electrostatics Next one, uh, this is the sensitive instrument are protected from the electric external electric field with the help of electrostatic shielding. And otherwise, uh, this is like a street lamp or cameras, whatever the thing, uh, electric, uh, electric gadget inside it, completely safe from the thundering or electrical shielding. It's a completely electrical sealed part. No any... Uh, they know anything is a harm in this part in this inside this part and uh, one of the best simple thing lightning and thundering can also explain by the electrostatics very simply you can see also uh, it's a very uh, it's a nozzle and the charge positively the droplets of the paint ripple each other but are attract to the objects and because the object is of negative charge and this nozzle is an sprayer so it is a positive charge so sprayer particles are sprayed all over the this negative charge and completely cover this part thank you